My name is Martina Stevens. I'm the elephant manager here at the Houston Zoo. I'm in charge of the day-to-day -day operation in the elephant area, and that includes um, the care of the zoo's herd of elephants, which is seven, three males and four female elephants. Mandy? Yeah? Let's go ahead and move him and start his stall. Okay. Working with elephants is, um, I mean, I think it's the greatest job ever, but you know, it's my chosen career. But it's fun because it's something new every day and it's a new challenge. If you want to grab him, I'll get the door. Ready? Yep. Alright, Ty, go around. Ty, move up. Come here. Come here, Ty. Good boy. Elephants are the largest living land animals, and Asian elephants can get up to, you know, 14,000 pounds. Thailand, our bull is, you know, right around 12,500 right now, and he's the father of our calves. They're highly intelligent creatures. I think they're probably as intelligent, if not more so, than like the great apes or dolphins, but I'm a little bit biased, of course, to them. Baylor and Tupelo are pretty much like any baby, I think. Um, you know, play, 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 eat, sleep, and Baylor's no exception. You know, he's fun, but he's definitely more of a cautious type personality for a little elephant than what we are used to. Now he's starting to come around a little bit more to us, and he likes to spend time with us and wants to do some training and things like that. Tupelo is the completely different personality. She's very social, outgoing, and independent. And um, she's younger than Baylor. She's only about four months old, whereas he now is nine months old. It's great to see them running together. They like to climb all over each other, play with toys. It's awesome to watch them develop and become more coordinated as they get older. They both have always loved water since they were really, really tiny, and bath is one of their seems to be one of their favorite parts of the day. So giving them something like the kiddie pool where they can completely lay down and play and splash and submerge is fun. And you know, we, we hope that it makes them happy. It makes us happy to watch. Go ahead and close that, Rob. Baylor, back up. Yep. Good. Historically, what we have seen is an animal will just show up with illness and die. And we don't know how they got it, we don't know where it comes from, we don't know what's going on. When we started our collaboration with Baylor a year and a half ago, our goal was to keep our babies alive at our zoo. and We wanted to know how to do that. And we're doing everything we can for that. And now we need to look at all the elephants in the country and even the world and what can we do with our special relationship with Baylor and our resources to find some answers.